I love my job. I just like being around fish and it's a passion to me. My name is Jan Ramirez. I'm the hatchery manager here at Pacifico Aquaculture. We're based in Ensenada, Baja California, Mexico. And what Pacifico does is we raise ocean striped sea bass. We have a broodstock that produces larvae, then turns into fry. Then we have an on-growing site at the island, which produces marketable sized fish that we sell to retailers or big chain stores like Whole Foods or small restaurants. This is our larval system. So basically, once the, the larvae is hatched from incubation, we will bring them to this system and they'll stay around 40 days. Here we're still discovering the basic protocols to rearing the, the species, still getting finely tuned. It's not like salmon, but it's an industry which has been developed and worked for like 30 years, which kind of the exciting part because you're, you're not doing exactly the same every day. This is basically a fry. 60 days old. This fish was hatched here in the hatchery, passed from larvae to fry, and will be ready to go to the farm in about two weeks when it gets to two to four grams. This is our farm. It's based in Todos Santos Island in Ensenada. It's five miles away from shore, so it's pretty close from where we actually work. At the end of the day, what the goal for the hatchery is, is to produce healthy, strong fish that you know that will survive going to, to the island. My job as a hatchery manager entitles, of course, the management side from taking care of people, text, daily work, daily activities. A typical day starts going around, talking to all our techs, how their fish look and how the system works. Then walk around, checking everything, all the components are, are working, all the pumps, filters, everything's in order. This is our automatic monitoring system, which basically we monitor every tank individually for oxygen, pH, and basically water stability. I think the basic skills that you need in order to be a manager, people skills, you need to know how to communicate. The other component is since we have all this equipment, pumps and filters, you need to know each component, how it actually works, what's its requirements, so you can actually problem solve most of the issues. So this is our own water treatment plant in our hatchery. We recycle about 85% of our water. I did my bachelor degree in oceanography. For the last year, I specialized in aquaculture. So I did my master's from Sterling University. I do think a degree helps because it gives you more of a basis that you need, for example, in fish biology or uh, water chemistry. Every day is a bit different, which is kind of playing mad scientist. You tinker a little bit with light and there's a reaction. You see if it's positive, it's negative. To become a hatchery manager, I would say you would need at least five years of experience and management experience. That's, that's a big part of it. You might have fish knowledge, or basic biology knowledge. But the actual management company, it's at a whole other level. Pacific Aquaculture is one of the many companies that are within the blue economy. I think it's new revolution. I think there's a lot of jobs that are gonna be opening. As a hatchery manager, you're able to turn a good living. Again, the industry is growing. I've always been in love with the sea. Aquaculture, producing fish, it's a passion to me. 